welcome to Hanoi. In today's video, we are going to be taking you on a street food tour with a local guide to try some famous cuisines here in Northern Vietnam. Are you ready? I can't wait. <laughs> So this is our gorgeous tour yeah. guide, Eleanor. She's going to be taking us around for the day to show us some beautiful food. At first, we raise the glass with everyone. And then, you strongly and loudly slogan in Vietnamese. It is Một Hai Ba Zo. Một Hai Ba Zo. Một Hai Ba Zo. Cheers. Cheers. You burn us up. Oh, it's only early in the morning. <laughs> yeah. Hope, uh, wake up. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> so I already feel drunk. <laughs> so it's going to be a good day. <gasps> oh my god, that's right, it's mine. Restaurant, we're going to be trying something new steam rice rolls. Yeah, steam rice rolls. I have no idea where it is, but I'm excited. <laughs> oh. It's smaller than lamb and it's called kamquat. This is fish sauce. Yeah, you squeeze it in your sauce. Squeeze it, okay. Now we have chopsticks. Just, <laughs> just can't do it. I've been in Asia for over a year of my life and I still can't use chopsticks. Ah, Maybe so you can teach me. She's not exaggerating, it's literally been a year. <laughs> Some people need help in life. Special service. <laughs> Look, it looks like I can do it, but then when I find something on the plate and try and get the pip out. Try and get the pip out. Well, actually, it's pretty hard to get the pips out. This is cinnamon with orange color and there's the pop meat. On top you see there's fried shallot, smaller than onion. There is dried shrimp, seafood, roll inside with wood ear mushroom and pork meat chopped like together. Chicken, like and then sure. they roll with steamed rice roll and cooking. There's a scrap already and you dip them in sauce for eating. Now, invite to you for okay. a So we got... Okay, I'm scared. <laughs> the fish sauce, I think, put that in mm. the so the pork with cinnamon is really good. Mm -hmm. I would never have put pork and cinnamon together, but there we go. Wow, that is actually really good. This one's really good. Yeah. yeah. Mushroom here is pork and mushroom. So it's mushroom and pork inside a rice wrap. It's yeah. rice, yeah. And it's actually really good. With egg. They also roll inside with mushroom and pork meat together inside. And now with the egg kind, we use spoon. Yeah, opportunity for oh, you. Oh, we use a spoon. We there we go. Yeah. Welcome to Rear's Club. So this is the same sort of thing, but egg and mushroom, right? Egg, 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 mushroom, and then we want to play. There's your corn bin. Mm. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come <laughs> on. The first meal was really good, and we definitely wouldn't have tried that on our own. So the reason we're actually doing this tour is because we've been in Vietnam for one month, and we have not really enjoyed... We've not, yeah, as I was saying, we've not really enjoyed the food that much, but I think it's because, oh my goodness, it's so hard to tell. <laughs> we've not really enjoyed the food that much because we've been really unadventurous because we don't know what anything is. This thing you look look like avocado. No, it is orange in Vietnam. Apple. It's no sour, it's only sweet. And with this, we know it's sweet or it's not sour salt, but it looks like it. It's a type of apple, you said? Yeah, custard apple. Custard apple. Yeah, you eat the white pack. Do you eat these? No, no, no. When you eat, you chew. Oh, I need two. Oh, no. Yeah, without seeds. No, no, no. I'm not sure about it. No. <laughs> no, it tastes like a... It got worse. It got worse, yeah. <laughs> the texture of it was like really um slimy. Yeah. yeah. No. It's different with sour sauce. What do you think? Yeah. I thought it was pretty nice, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. How are you mine? Not... Hilly them, thanks. Take it or leave it. Yeah. Do it anything. <laughs> 
so they have so many strange things like eels and snails and are we gonna be trying this? Yeah, it's another cup of eel. Are we gonna try? Uh, no, it's not no? Okay. <laughs> It's a little bit now. Okay, oh yeah, later cooked. Yeah. We try? Yeah, we need to cook, but next meal we're a little adventurous. Ah, but no this thing. Okay, yeah. we're gonna try something adventurous anyway. A few moments later. No, I don't know, the adventurous things in yeah, testing. No. Yeah, inside look like the sausage with the blood of pork, pork meat and basil. Oh, I no. tried this in Japan but by complete accident when they dished up like loads of skewers of meat and I didn't even know what it was and I was still like almost sick by the I mean this is what we sign up for, right? Oh, pork intestine. Oh, I feel like I was going to be sick then yeah, just by so, saying it. Yeah. They put pork meat in the intestine. Yeah, okay, intestine and also better. blood and basil. Then they put oh, them around. I'm feeling sick by the second. Okay, uh, oh, Martin's getting I'm straight in. Go on, Martin. Show us how it's done, mate. Not that bad. It's like a mixture between black pudding and a sausage. Can you ask not, the cut of the Not overly nice, but smaller, smaller. smaller. Yeah. Can I get that smaller? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, never leave. Oh, oh here, fine. Let's go, go. How about you, Trash? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be worse. You're gonna be worse. <laughs> I don't know why you're laughing because you're next. I'm not laughing, I'm dying. <laughs> you're next. And if you don't, I'll point you at this. It's cutting it really small for me. <laughs> oh, oh, even the way it's falling apart is making my. Oh. It's actually not that bad. <laughs> Too adventurous. So, how about you? Yeah. Try a little bit more. Me and Martin liked it, didn't we, Martin? Yeah, why not? <laughs> so there have been. Definitely. I mean, I definitely won't have it again. I'm but sorry, mum. <laughs> Sorry mum and dad right now. Okay, so I hate to be insulting because, you know, this is the cuisine that people eat here and this is why we try it, but it's totally not for me. It just tasted like blood. But I tried it. I'm proud of myself. Not like the grubs in our mental eye vlog, which I did try and was almost So here in Hanoi, you cannot walk on the pavement because they are just so many motorbikes everywhere and they only go on the pavement. So yeah, it's mad. you have to walk in the road and you have to develop eyes in the back of your head. But there's eight. You cannot see. There's 8.5 million people living in Hanoi, yes. and there's six million motorbikes. How mental! So no wonder it's crowded. It's very Hanoian. <laughs> yeah, they frying here around 30 minutes. Around 100 donuts for one time for frying. Wow. And they're selling for many retailers around here up to ten thousand dollars for every day. Ten thousand donuts. They sell ten thousand donuts every day, so they must be good. And this sounds like a bit of me, a little bit better than the uh, intestine sausage. So I got a coconut filled donut with sugar. Let's give it a go. Wow. Yeah. You can shake it something inside. Um, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You see. Oh. Mm. Mm. Oh, this is so good. So this is a sandworm. They take it from the sea. They fry them. They put them in a pancake. They put it with egg, pork, season it with dill. So we're going to try it now. Oh, it's, it's a bit hot. Oh, it smells nice to be fair. Let's put it in the sauce. Chili sauce. Oh, that makes anything good. Hello. Hello. Get it roll. Mmm. Really good. Yeah? Mmm. It's actually really good. Hello. 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 When two vloggers meet. Where are you from? China. Oh, China. nice to meet you. And, and you. We're from England. Oh, England. Nice to meet you. We can follow each other. I, I, I love Manchester. I love Manchester. Manchester United. Yeah, I love Manchester. Nice to meet you. <laughs> We're at our next spot, trying some punch. We had this yesterday. It's actually really good. Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> 
Yeah. Haven't had bun chai yet, I'm excited. Yeah. So we just found out that it's actually tradition around here to have a beer with your bun chai. Yeah, Something we didn't do yesterday. What are you doing? <laughs> With the meat in here is the grilling pork meat. Mm. Some bread and white uh, slice. This is carrot and green papaya. Oh, yeah, they green together. papaya. Yeah. Oh. Besides soup, we have the rice noodle and veggie more. They will bring for us and add in your soup. Lovely. Thank you. Lovely. Real Almond. spirit animal. What, garlic? Spoon. Oh. Yes. <laughs> so Sam's if you not know, how perfectly around her head is. Sam's dad, when we first met, said that he recognised me and then he got out a wooden spoon from his kitchen That's drawer and said, Are you yeah. serious? No, I'm being well, serious. Literally, they are vertically identical. <laughs> uh, a little to a little. Only a little. Okay. So we've got some oregano, some salad and different herbs you put inside the buncha along with garlic and chilli and basically whatever else you want to put in. And it tastes absolutely gorgeous. Mm. <laughs> you fuck that one up. <laughs> mm. It's so good. So, what would you rate it? I'd rate that a solid eight. Yeah? Yeah, what about you? Yeah, what you say? Eight? Yeah, eight. Yeah, it's a resounding eight. <laughs> <laughs> So the bun chow is definitely my favourite thing so far but we've still got a few more things to try and my stomach is so full. <sighs> it's only, we started at 11 o'clock so it's a little bit early to like eat and eat and eat. Uh, I'd recommend doing it a little bit later but because we're showing you guys we have to have daylight for the video so um, yeah but they do the tour at like half five I think and half six and I think I would go for that one in the future. You know what I love in Vietnam? This. This is such, such a vibe. This is such a vibe, yeah, I love it. Even though I've got really long legs. And now I go to the order with beef jerky salad meal and we eat them in small bowl, really nice. So something we love about Vietnam is these cute little stalls on the side of the street and you can normally get like the best food. Peanut, with red color is the beef jerky dry yeah. beef. There is normal beef you see. With green color, vegetable is oregano and shape look like noodles. It is green papaya. Put everything in your bowl for missing for eating. Peanut, beef jerky, normal beef. Okay. You get sauce at bottom to your bowl. Mm. Yeah, we've been doing it wrong uh, this entire month, yeah. haven't we? <laughs> this is why you need to do a food tour, because I was like, what is this on the bottom of the plate? Water? Look what you've done. This is why I need to use chopsticks, but I just can't. <laughs> You're making a bowl of backwards. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying, alright? Where's the beef jerky? Yeah. Oh my god. Guys, I've mastered the chopstick. Look at you doing it. <gasps> This is the first time in a year! And now I've I've suddenly forgot how to use it. Mm. <laughs> no. oh my God. Okay, so we've all agreed that that was by far the best meal so far. So far that was the best meal so far. Yeah. What is wrong with me? So we all agreed that that was the best meal so far. Yeah, it was delicious. It, it was, was delicious. like thin slices of uh, beef mm. with um, green papaya and some herbs and it was so fresh and tasty and I think we'll definitely be ordering that again. Just been told that the next meal is a banh mi and uh, that is the one thing that we've actually had an abundance of. We have eaten banh mi every, every single, single day, day since yeah. arriving in Vietnam because it's safe, it's nice yeah. and uh, the yeah. bread is unreal. <laughs> really good. So I think we may give this a miss. I'm so full. Yeah. I'm gonna save it for the more adventurous stuff like yes. a snail. Like a snail, yeah. <laughs> so our next stop for the banh mi, this is the restaurant. So we're gonna try a banh mi with pate and sweet potato because we haven't tried that yet at all. Usually we go for chicken or egg and this will be something different. So yeah, let's give it a go. We have pate kind for eating. It's like with half meat and cheese. Oh, they remember my no coriander request. Are you going to say anything or are you just going to say mmm? 
Oh, it's really good. It's good. It's the French inspired bread. It's really good. It's one good thing that the French brought over to Vietnam the bread. Inside, you add anything, you're lovely. Alright, we're off to our next destination now. I got all food in my teeth. But I'm so full right now. So, definitely do this tour on an empty stomach. So, we're gonna be here to try snails. I've actually really wanted to try one for a while because we watched the Netflix series uh, Street Food Asia and there was a woman on there who cooks snails and it was all about her life story and it was really interesting and I said mm, you know what actually like I'm gonna give it a go when I go back to Asia so here we are let's give it a go <laughs> This is real traveling right now, guys. Yeah, you've got to try stuff if you can't, like, even if you don't like it. Like, you've got to just dive right into culture. You know, yeah, it's what people eat, so you need yeah. to embrace you need it. Need to embrace it. Even though, yeah, it might make you squirm. <laughs> there you go. Oh, for lovely. This could Get take it. someone's eyes yeah, out. Like that, like that. Like that. Oh my and God. you dip in sauce. Then. Where is the French do it, though? And then jumpy. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> It's yours. Okay, now we have the water eggs. Alright, my water's gone. I have plenty of water left. I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can. You ate a worm in the jungle from a tree. Of course you can. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, go on. Martin's digging right in. He's, he's not wasting Fucking any time. Fucking snail is roasting hot. Is it? <laughs> yeah. Then I'm back to you. You can go closer for. Oh, yeah, God. For really yeah. nice. Really, really nice. nice. I don't think it's done, it's got a job again today. I truly haven't. There. You can start with the small one. Yeah, I'll start with the small one. Yeah, with small one, you have to. Oh, there we go. There's a fun size one. Oh. Oh, it's this? No, not bad. Yeah, <laughs> it's better than it's looking. Mm. But, uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, what's the joke? Yeah, it's not, yeah, it's not bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh God! Give me a second for that one. <laughs> I think I think it's real. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, I'm not doing the big one. The little oh. one. Just drop it in there first. Oh my God! Okay, ready. quite nice. <laughs> but you thought that was bad. Really? We've got complete it opposite taste like taste buds. tastes like mushrooms. <laughs> okay. <laughs> go, for, go for a big one. That's a black color. Uh, it's well, a I'm going for the big bad boy now. No, I don't know if I can do a big one. No, no, if you, if you, if you, if you think one, you're but... odd. No, I don't think I'm not odd. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. No. No, okay, I changed my mind. <laughs> oh. No, that was better. I swear. No, 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 that one was too big. No. Sorry, it's Andy, actually so chaotic. If you want to relax in holiday, don't come to Hanoi. <laughs> but it's uh, an experience, let's just say. It's one of the most crazy cities we've ever been. But we are going to India, so uh, it's preparing us a little bit for that. Time for some Vietnamese coffee. The thing I've been waiting for since we arrived in Vietnam is to try an egg coffee and I waited till this moment and I'm so buzzing. Apparently it's delicious. Martin looks buzzing as well. Sorry, I'm yeah, feeding yeah. Nardra on that food. <laughs> 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 I'm kind of like... <laughs> okay. Same brain. Uh, Cacao flour. Cacao flour. Okay. And then it's egg and coffee as well. Uh, spoon for you, chilling with them. You have to do it. You, didn't, you read the instructions and you didn't do it. Oh, I didn't do it. It's the knowledge. It's the knowledge. Oh, it's the time. Oh. It's real life. It's so we've had it for like 30 seconds and we've already messed it up. Let's do it properly, Ria. Yes, okay, so three turns. And then you fold up. So try it. And first. then spread. Yeah. Okay, you, you did do it right. Mm. My oh, oh my god, it's so good. Mm. It's so thick and it's really creamy and it doesn't taste like egg at all. It's unreal. Yeah, try the egg on top first. Oh, okay. So okay. with the spoon now. Mm. Tell you what. Enough. It's 
tell you what, take this idea back to England, you make millions. That was literally like 10 seconds. So good. Yum. So the best thing about Vietnam, I think, is the coffee and the landscapes. They're absolutely beautiful. But they have like coconut coffee. And now I've tried egg coffee, white coffee, coffee with condensed milk. Oh, all of it is just freaking insane. I've literally had so much coffee that my teeth are now yellow. So I need to whiten them when we get home. Okay, we just heard that it's dessert time. This is the most beautiful cat I have ever seen. Look, he's so soft. Oh, Gaff to take this cat. Come on a food tour, I'm leave with a cat. Alright, come with Gunny. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> it's gonna go everywhere. It's like beanie. So what is this, sorry? It's dessert with the whistle. It's like for me, some kind of sweet thing, like white color. It's in coconut water, crunchy from dried coconut, and some kind of beef, also banana. Mmm, yeah. how is it? It's really good. Yeah. Really tastes like a bowl of cereal. So we're going to say goodbye now, that is the end of our tour, but we had such a good time. We tried some really strange food, but some really delicious food too, and we highly recommend you come with Eleanor to try out all the lovely foods here in Hanoi. Nice to see you, you are so welcome. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> so what did you think? I really enjoyed that, and I think we were quite brave, because yeah. I would have never tried any of that in England or pretty much anywhere else in the world. No. And Definitely like, not snails. We've never done a, a street food tour in Asia before, no. even though we've been here so long, but Vietnam has a very adventurous food, so yeah. we thought, why not? So guys, if you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below, and we'll see you in the next one.